My name is Nati Howard. I'm the founder of the Reline Ranch, and I'm here to talk to you about our upcoming program, Foundations for Liquid Nutrition. This is a nine-week online program in which I guide you and teach you all about liquid nutrition. So we will have an opportunity to really dive deep into the science, the art, and the pro, the kind of the process, the transformation that happens within our bodies when we begin to include liquid nutrition in our lives, both in a daily basis, but also through uh, feasting or fasting as we kind of go deeper into the program. Um, in today's world, because of all the toxicity that we're experiencing, it is extremely important to uh, gift ourselves the opportunity of uh, kind of nutritious and uh, high density uh, foods. And it could be anywhere from um, fruits and vegetables to uh, elixirs and teas made out of uh, our plant allies, as you see all in the garden, but also, um, you know, kind of medicinal mushrooms and barks of uh, trees and other um, allies that we are just kind of learning about as a community. Uh, so I want to start our process today with wheatgrass. Wheatgrass is one of the most powerful uh, liquid allies that we can drink. Um, it is exactly the same as the blood in its, in its um, chemical composition, molecular structure, except one has iron and one has magnesium at, at its core. So our bodies know, you know, it's through liquid nutrition we begin to speak our body's language. And in doing so, we allow our digestive systems to uh, rest. You know, 70% of our energy gets spent in the digestive system. So when we allow that, you know, 60% of that energy to rest, our bodies can begin to rebuild, to regenerate, to rejuvenate. And then that's where healing happens, that's where um, cleansing happens, but also that's where a next step in our evolution happens, both physically and spiritually. So we, you know, we will talk about the power of wheatgrass, we will talk about the power of juicing, and you'll have videos, demonstrations about different um, juices, both green and not. We will talk about allies like ginger and turmeric, which is what's here. And, um, you know, their power to cleanse the blood, their power as anti-inflammatories. We'll talk about smoothies, and this is a wonderful smoothie made with berries, uh, protein powder, coconut water, greens that have broccoli sprouts in this smoothie. And again, what's the difference between a juice and a smoothie and why they're both important um, tools in our protocol. This is a fermented coconut water which aids in our re-establishment of um, kind of healthy gut flora. Then we also have elixirs, and this one is made out of uh, chaga mushroom, reishi, uh, ta um, tahiba tea, which I don't have here. This is a cat's claw bark, tree bark, and horsetail. And you know, when we begin to drink the wisdom of our allies, our plant allies, that uh, wisdom, that nourishment, that all those minerals come into our bodies and our bodies begin to express themselves through that, which is a really fabulous and beautiful process, not only in our own healing, but also in kind of the, the, this process of coherence, this process of action through coherent integration. Uh, we, I will also be talking about the power of spring water, which is what's here, and why um, it's not only about not putting into our bodies the chemicals and the chlorides and all the things that are in tap water, but it's also about accessing the wisdom of the earth that begins to um, rise up in a spiral-like fashion and come up as spring water. So again, it's not just about the physicality of our liquid nutrition and what that will do to our bodies, but more so about the process of accessing wisdom, both through our plant allies, through you know nutrient-dense food, but also through water. Right here I have homemade and just freshly made cashew milk, but it's still very hot. So when we make milk from nuts and we make it fresh, there's no additives to it. And it's very delicious and dense and um, nutty in taste. Uh, there we go. And then I really like to make, um, I'll add ginger and turmeric to my milk and a little bit of honey and a little bit of bee pollen. So through our time together we will also be discussing different power foods and superfoods and how we can again elevate our drinks to the next level. So here we have green, a mixed green powder made out of different grasses and I usually add about a teaspoon of this to my green juice 
along with some hemp seeds, along with some flax seeds. And again, I'm kind of elevating the functionality of what I'm taking in. This is bee pollen, which I'll use in smoothies. And it is bee pollen is really the nectar of the gods. It's, it's the pollen of you know, the immune system of nature. And then there are goji berries, which I'll add to the smoothies, I'll add to my tea sometimes, I'll add into the milk sometimes. And then we have different allies like cacao butter and cacao powder, maca and mesquite. And I will go through one by one into why these are important to add into our nutrition. And you know, as you can see, it's quite, quite varied. So, you know, when we think of like nutrition and when we think what's available in the market, the market has changed a lot, which is wonderful. But we have a lot of power that we can reclaim and health that we can reclaim through our own uh, doing through our own Mom? learning of one second please uh, through our own learning of um, kind of self-respect and gifting ourselves the opportunity to rise gifting ourselves the opportunity to heal so I look forward to uh, you joining us through this program there will be a Facebook group as well a private Facebook group and the program is divided into lessons so each week you receive access to a different lesson you get to keep all of the lessons and it, through the process I will also talk about what I call the seven um, living code uh, aspects of the nutrition which I think are really uh, you know again they, they kind of take us a, uh, they embrace the physicality of the nutrition but they take us into an, an, our next evolution and why it is important to include them into our lives and um, as we journey into the nutrition, we realized that this is not just a journey of our physical body, although more, for most of us it began that way. It is really a journey to step forward into the world through sacred action, through more coherent action, and to heal. You know, we've been, we've been given this opportunity. We live at the best of times where the wisdom is out there for us to access. So I invite you to join me. I invite you to um, give yourself the opportunity. And again, we begin together this nine week online program on August 22nd. You can check the full curriculum online uh, at my website natihower.com and um, that is it. I will be answering questions uh, in a few days through Facebook so if you have any questions about the program please get in touch and that's it. Have a lovely day from the Mandela Garden. I am Natihower.